the Dwesa Kleppe Nature Reserve, an important cog in the Eastern Cape Conservation World. It also includes a marine protected area. Residents from the Dwesa and Kleppe villages were removed from the reserve in the early 1980s, but they have successfully claimed the land back through the restitution process. Residents claim there was a settlement agreement between them and Land Affairs Department, which is not being adhered to. The argument was that the nature reserve will operate in the form of coal management, but that failed from the onset because there were some discrepancies. Community members were promised that they will benefit and get 50% of the proceeds from the reserve. If there were any rhinos or buffaloes sold, we would get 50%. Young people were to be employed here. Learners would be receiving bursaries from the reserve. As the residents of Ntubeni, after we were not satisfied with the ECPTA, we decided to close the nature reserve. This is the first time you are allowed to get inside the reserve because the guards close the gates on us when we come here. The successful land claimants say they have not received any benefit from the proceeds from the reserve. The residents of this area also say the nature reserve is not properly maintained, while their children are unemployed. Our forefathers' farms were closed here. We used to get milk from these farms and we're not struggling. We thought the settlement agreement will improve our livelihoods, but nothing. There was a camp here. My mother used to work here and would come here and sell milk to white people who were here. We have a problem because all the promises that were made here were never been fulfilled. We are made fools and sent from pillar to post because we are uneducated. We stopped fighting this. The concerns raised here will be taken up. I came to see them so that can, I can hear from them what the issue is and together we can find a solution. So um, I've just been invited and uh, they will have the opportunity to tell me their side of the story. I will go back and investigate what might have happened between the promise and now. But ha coming here, I realize that this is a beautiful site for tourism and I am very willing to help in whatever way so that we can restore this uh, nature reserve. Um, and if the beneficiaries are truly the, uh, the right owners of the place, I am available to assist them. Uh, and if there is any legal impediment, I'm willing to look into that and see how we can resolve this. The state of the road leading to the reserve and general safety concerns were also put on the table. But while this community hopes the MPS will be resolved soon, the reserve remains closed. For Nusam Flegu, the SABC News, Willowvale.